Good afternoon, everyone. It's Widowed Mom Raising Two Sons back with another video. And Coco is with me. And it is Wednesday, May 1st, 2019. I can't believe it's May already. Coco is a little sad today. Our Yorkie, Kai, is at the groomers today. So Coco's been all out of sorts because his brother's not here with him today. So he's been staying. He always stays close to me, but really extra close to me today, haven't you? But I am back with another Dollar Tree haul. I went into the Dollar Tree and I found a few new items, not many. I'm going to put him down. I think he wants to go lay back down. There you go, babe. I did purchase several repeat items, so I will just go ahead and get started. I hope it's wonderful weather where you are. Um, it's cloudy. Luckily, it's not raining right this minute. We had a lot of thunderstorms last night, a lot and lots of thunderstorms. We've had a lot of rain in the past couple days, and it's causing the river to rise and it's starting to flood in certain areas. So I'm praying that we don't get any more rain so that doesn't flood and cause any problems. So, yeah, I purchased, I must stand up. This is a repeat purchase. I usually purchase this at Dollar Tree or Walmart. Um, I just happened, I thought I'll pick them up since they had them, but I picked up the Gatorade, cool blue. That's the flavor my kids like. They like this one in the orange. And so I picked, and these are the 32 ounces, which you can get these at Walmart for a dollar also. But I went ahead and picked them up at Dollar Tree. So I picked up two, four, six, and seven. I did clear the shelf in my store. That's all they had on that one. And then whenever these are in, I always grab them because my Dollar Tree doesn't always have these in stock. So they are the Ultra Shine Dish Detergent Pods. These make my dishes look so good in the dishwasher. They are excellent, excellent to use. Sorry, I'm just gonna shut my phone off there for a minute. So if you haven't tried these, try these. I really, really like them. And I picked up some trash bags. I was low. I don't, these aren't the best quality trash bags, but I thought until I can get, till I place my grocery order from Walmart, I will have those on hand. I picked up this splash toy. It is a dolphin, I think, dolphin or a whale. I don't know, and it doesn't say. <laughs> I picked that up. Not that we have a pool, but um, if we go to Grandma's Pond or just to have, I picked that up. And then Trenton always wants goggles, so I picked him up some goggles. For when we go swimming where I live in town we don't live very far from our public pool and so um, in the summertime we like to go to the pool and hang out and it, it's nice we can actually walk so which makes it very convenient so and this is a repeat purchase my dogs like this the Alpo um, savory beef flavor and I picked up three boxes. I've never had any problems with it. They they like it. My dogs are not picky when it comes to snacks or food or anything like that. So I'm very fortunate there. Um, I picked up some of the Dollar Tree toilet paper. I always pick that up when I go in the store. I always pick that up. I picked these up. The long... Gives me the long squirrel. Can't talk today. I picked these up for when we go to my sister's. We always have a monthly get together, and when she hosts it, we have it out on her beautiful patio. 
She's got a fire pit. And I thought the kids could roast um, hot dogs on here or marshmallows for their s'mores. And then they're not close to the, you know, don't have to stand close to the fire. Because I know I don't like to stand close to the fire. So I picked up a package of these. And when I go back in on Friday, if they still have some left, I think I'll pick up even more. So then that way we can have those on hand at my sister's house. And then I picked up some of the little cups of applesauce. Trenton, my youngest, likes applesauce. And he uses applesauce to take his medicine with. So I picked that up. And then I picked up more of the cake pants. I picked, you get two in a set. So I picked up three sets, two, four, six. So I have six all together. I, you know, I use these for anything and everything. Um, to bake cakes in, to bake. The other night I used them, I made, um, chicken drumsticks. So I put the chicken drumsticks in here and I baked them in here. That way you just throw them away when you're done. Quick and easy. That's what I like. Quick and easy cleanup. So I picked up more of those. My oldest is a Chex Mix type kid. He loves it. Loves it, loves it. So they still, I was lucky enough, they still had their traditional so I picked up four bags of the traditional Chex Mix for him. They didn't have the kind Trenton and I like. I'm kind of addicted to that cheddar. So they didn't have any of that left. So I didn't get it. So, but he, my my oldest, Tyler, he loves Chex, Chex Mix. I can't talk today. It's Wednesday. I need to be able to talk. We're halfway through the week. And it's May 1st, so yeah, it's getting to the end of the school year for my kid. Well, my oldest gets out the last week of May. He gets out two day. he gets out the Wednesday after Memorial Day. And then Trenton, my youngest, will get out June 1st because they had makeup days from the snow. Even though we have e-learning, you can only have three consecutive e-learning days <clears throat> and Trenton School District, my oldest son's school district, you can have as many e-learning days in a row. So that's why he's getting out earlier than Trenton. But I found these feather pins. They are so cute. Here's like this pink one with the blue. And I already took the sticker off and it didn't come off, so I'm going to have to get that off and then there's this one with the purple and the blue and the purple base this is all silver and then this is this one is just a tad different it's got the purple at the top and then the blue and then the purple these write really good i was using them this morning and they write really really good and then my store finally got the um pom-pom pins in even though i picked these up uh, hauled these a while ago i got them from my store in another town so i did grab a purple and a blue and be watching i'm gonna be having another giveaway soon so these may just be included one of these in my giveaway so and then i found what Everyone has been hauling, and I'm anxious to try. I haven't heard any reviews on these yet. Um, so I plan on doing this. I don't know when. Maybe if I have time to do it tonight, I'll try it. The exfoliating foot mask. So to use, it says, thoroughly cleansed feet. Cut open package along the dotted line. Place your feet inside the gel-filled socks. Allow treatment to work for 60 to 90 minutes, then remove. Thoroughly wash and dry feet. Dead skin, cracked heels, and calluses will simply peel away in about four to seven days after use. Do not use more than once a month. So I'm going to try this. 
This is the exfoliating one. So I picked up three. So I'm going to try it. And that way, I don't know if my store will have any more left by the time I get there. I, I'm sure these are going to be flying off the shelves because everybody's going to want to try them. But I got the exfoliating and then I got the moisturizing. Softens cracked heels and rough dry feet. Moisturizes and exfoliates. So, and the same thing, thoroughly cleanse feet, cut open package, place your feet inside the gel filled socks, allow treatment to work 60, 90, 90 minutes, um, thorough, you take them off, and then you wash and dry your feet, um, and then it said dead skin, cracked heels, and calluses will simply peel away in about four to seven days after use. So I picked up two of the moisturizing ones. So it sounds like they pretty much do the same exact thing. Like I said, I haven't seen any reviews yet. I've seen a lot of people haul them. So hopefully I can, you know, test this out and report back. Because it says four to seven days is when it'll start to peel away. So I guess we will see if this works or not. So this is a global beauty care item and you get one pair foot mask in each package. So I'm going to have to try that out. I will try to try that out tonight if I get a chance. So that is my Dollar Tree haul. It was a small Dollar Tree haul. I just didn't, my Dollar Tree really hasn't gotten anything new in since they got all the spring and summer items in. I haven't seen a lot of Mother's Day things, so I, I don't know. They must just be running behind. I, it's hit or miss with my DT. So, I appreciate you watching. I will be back with another Dollar Tree haul, hopefully on Friday. I do have to go for um, a job orientation. So I'm very excited. I did get a part-time job for the summer. I am very excited about it and I can't wait. So I will definitely do my Walmart grocery haul on Friday morning sometime or Friday afternoon and hopefully make it into my Dollar Tree. So thanks for watching. Have a fabulous Wednesday and May 1st. And yeah, it's going to be time to go get my kiddos soon. So have a great day. Thanks for tuning in. If you're new, please tap the subscribe button and then tap the bell so you get notifications when I post a video. So thanks for tuning in, everyone. Have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Thank you, everyone. Bye-bye.